The state government is moving to release inmates early and send them home to relieve prison overcrowding. Only low security offenders would be considered under the plan, but the public sector union says it won't solve the problem. South Australia's prison overcrowding crisis has seen inmates shipped to police cells, one transfer prompting an angry backlash within Yatla only weeks ago. The government now looking to squeeze in more prisoners wherever it can. We are creating some additional beds within existing buildings. We are creating some additional uh, space in existing prison footprints, in other words, new buildings. The minister confirmed another plan was also being looked at to let some inmates go home early. We're exploring ways to make sure that people who are not a risk to the community can be actually uh, be monitored and uh, looked after on the outside. But the minister says changes to the law would be needed to allow selected inmates into home detention. The people who, who can be home can be placed on home detention at the moment are being assessed at the moment. There are restrictions in the law at the moment. The opposition says it's a step in the right direction. When the minister is able to put some detail on his suggestion, we'll happily have a look at that. But the union representing prison guards says the government plan to release inmates on home detention will have little impact. We're seeing prisoners being moved around on a daily basis and these numbers are not going to reduce, they're going to get worse. The only way to deal with that is, is a significant infrastructure spend. The government axed plans to build a new prison five years ago. Hannah Dawkins, Nine News.